what's up y'all how y'all doing we can make it real quick on the intro because i don't know what's going on right now um welcome back bienvenidos a mi canal okay if you know me thank you so much for coming back to see you girl if you don't recognize this face my name is latrice nice to meet you this right here is faith by latrice where faith is the muscle we exercise down here now let's get into it no dilly dallying all right y'all so good what um so i'm sitting in my car you know can y'all see me what's going on I'm sitting in my car, right? And I'm reading my the book that I told y'all I was reading. Um, the Heart Healing Book. And then I stopped and I started talking to God about some real stuff. I was like, look. Um, I was asking God for favor. For this next, for like my right now. I'm asking God for favor. I was asking God for wisdom, for grace to do what I need to do. Um, and favor for my next, for my now, for all the things, right? And then I had to stop because God was like, hold on, I'm going to need you to stop talking. Just sit for a second. So I start praying. I'm like, okay, boom. I don't know what's going on. So then he just, um, I took one of my devotional books out and read the verse. And it was Proverbs 23, 26. Now, in this heart healing book, it's talking about right now that I'm reading in, uh, the section I'm in is talking about boundaries and setting boundaries to prevent, uh, to ensure safety and to keep out unsafe, unsafe people and unsafe things, right? And then it's talking about boundaries to uh, establish early on in relationships. <sighs> establish boundaries early on in relationships. Um, whatever kind of relationship it is, right? People outside that you meet, that you want to bring into your life. And it's, the example I kept giving was parents setting boundaries for children, right? As babies in the crib, then as they get a little bit older, the playpen, then a little bit older, the backyard with the fence, whoever has those. Now, not everybody got backyard fences, but you hear what I'm saying. Um, parents establishing boundaries, right? And I don't know if it's on this parent thing, but um, Proverbs twenty three twenty six says, in this uh, New Living Translation, it says, Oh, my son, give me your heart. May your eyes take delight in following my ways. Okay. That's God saying, may you take delight in following my ways, my instructions. It was talking about God also setting boundaries in the Garden of Eden with Adam and Eve. But not even that, setting boundaries with creating the world, right? Separating the sky, separating, putting boundaries in the sky, right? With light and with darkness, calling it day and night. And boundaries with the land and the water, right? That the water shall not cross over into the land. That's why we have, you know, different countries and continents and the oceans stay where, it, where it's at. And the land stays where it's at and they don't cross each other that's boundaries right for safety because if we have a flood that means the water didn't cross over boundary it ain't supposed to cross into okay destruction now in this uh english standard version um the and then i just read y'all stay with me okay i just read y'all proverbs 23 26 i said let me just open my bible and see what it say in the actual book that i got now i get to a verse that i didn't even just read like i'm a couple verses up so now I'm in Proverbs 23, 22. Listen to your father who gave you life and do not despise your mother when she is old. Now, just so y'all know, this off the cuff. I just picked up my phone and started recording because what? So this for somebody. I don't know who it's for. It could be for me. Whatever. It's for somebody. Okay. And what I got from this, one more time, listen to your father who gave you life and do not despise your mother when she is old. What I just got from that is about authority. Somebody got an issue with authority. Somebody has an issue with authority and they and don't realize the boundaries that were set or that are being set right now are for your protection. Woo! I'm sorry, I just screamed really loud into the phone. I'm sorry, but listen, I'm not sorry, actually. The boundaries that are being set right now and I, this is for an adult. Like, I don't know what's going on right now. The boundaries that are being set for you, you don't like them, but they're for your protection. You don't understand that without these boundaries set, without these parameters, there's going to be destruction in your life. There's going to be destruction in whatever section, in whatever area of your life that you have these strong boundaries that are set right now. They are for your protection. They are to guide you and they're to keep you safe up until you get to the next thing, right? You're being protected right now. Lord have mercy. Whoever this is for, I'm going to need you to grab it. <laughs> Grab it now. Grab it now. Agarralo. Please. That's what I got. And this is, if you want to know, Proverbs 23, 22. And it's in the English Standard Version. One more time. Listen to your father who gave you life. And do not despise your mother who is when she is old. Now, you could take that, what it's saying. But also take what I just said about authority. And about people higher than you. Giving you insight 
and covering that you're unaware of that you don't see. All right, that's it. I love you and I love me. Si nadie te ha dicho hoy que te estoy hablando ahora mismo con mi suéter aquí en 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 la en el carro, en coche con luz prendida. I love you. Um, I love you so much. Uh, share this with somebody. I don't know who needed somebody needed it because this wasn't even playing. I don't know what's going on. Um, cause listen, life be life in, but get what? We're going to prosper regardless. Bye.